Johnny Rodriguez here with Crease Coach. We're going to talk a little bit about leadership in the cage today. All right, what it takes to be a good leader, whether it's in the cage, anywhere on the field, outside, in the classroom, wherever you're at, all right, two big things I, I, I think are involved with that. It's responsibility and influence. Responsibility meaning your, your responsibility to show up to practice on time, your responsibility to show up mentally prepared, physically prepared, ready to go, wearing the right apparel, the right jersey, the right color socks, whatever you got to be doing, you're doing it the right way. The other thing, influence. All right, how are you influencing your teammates, your peers, to be doing something better, to make themselves better, to make the, the team better as a whole? All right, those two things are huge attributes to leadership in general. All right, when you're in the cage, however, the best goalies, the best leaders inside the 6x6 six six go above and beyond that call of duty. All right, they're the ones that are making sure the defense, when coach isn't watching, is doing everything they're supposed to be doing. If, if they're not talking loud enough, we got to talk louder. We got to always talk louder. Communication is the biggest part about defense in any sport. Things break down all the time on defense. No matter what you're doing, they're going to break down. Things aren't perfect. They never will be. But when you talk about it, when you can talk to your brothers around you, all right, you can then communicate to them so everybody's on the same page of understanding. Very important. Another thing about goalie is what you bring into the crease with you. All right, when you start a game and goalies cross and they dab each other up, everybody that is cheering for your team, whether it's your teammates, your parents, fans in the stands, whoever it is, everybody's looking at you. What are you going to do to motivate that group of people? All right, so what I like to do is a little, you know, I'll sprint back, I'll hit the pipe, I'll do a little Father, Son, Holy Spirit, and I'll get a nice little jump in there. All right, just and maybe a little punch, all right, just to get just to get the boys going. All right, when you make a big save, all right, your teammates are all jacked up on the sideline when you make a big one-on-one -on -one save. You can make a nice stop, all right, and if you just sit there and just put your hands on your hips, all right, and give no emotion to it, they're not going to get as fired up. But if you come out here, you make a big save, and you give it one of these, all right, that's going to fire everybody up. So the presence that you have in net is huge when it comes to leadership. Don't forget about the other two, responsibility and influence, also a huge part about being a leader. See you next time.